or Lucas Media. So I just made a video, the well, first video on Diddy. I'll just say this is basically a part two. So I'm looking, I'm seeing now that he's arrested on federal charges. I, my bad, I was assuming it was just state, but clearly the feds, but it makes sense because he was raided by the feds not too long ago. We all know the feds have a 90 something percent conviction rate. I think it's at least 95%, might be a little bit higher than that. But let me, let me just say this. If this don't let if this don't tell you anything, this should definitely let you know that no matter how big you are, when they when when they tired of you, stuff like this gonna happen because this man has made people hundreds of millions of dollars. He's made his record companies hundreds of millions of dollars. The people who help him distribute Sean John, he's helped make them hundreds of millions of dollars. The people with um Ciroc. Y'all remember Ciroc used to be cheap. Diddy Diddy came to it, you know, I'm a Ciroc boy and he used to have a Ciroc parties down here in Atlanta. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Ciroc was like the biggest drink. Then he came out with Revolt. And then it just seems like, even real quick, going back to music, just with Biggie. You know, you had one of the greatest artists of all time, of all time in any genre. It just, it it really lets you know how we are, we're disposable. Honestly, we're disposable. Even though he made them people tens of hundreds of millions, if not billions of dollars. But we don't know, honestly, what he was charged on. A lot of people speculating, like I said, is, you know, what I said earlier in, in the first video. But you never know. I mean, when they raided it, who, who knows what they found. But one thing about the feds is when when they, when they come in, they usually going to be usually gonna get a conviction right now. They might have it out for Diddy, but the feds got the kind of money and resources like Diddy where they can just keep draining them over and over again, uh, his, his legal pockets, which is why he probably got, what, a good $100 million in, uh, in cash. So we don't know, man, but will Diddy go to jail or have to do real time? We don't know, but man, you know, it's, just, it, it's, it's crazy because the biggest people they've taken down are, are people that look like us and you saw them go rise all the way up. You know, I remember before Diddy had Sean John when he was just still trying to break his artist, you know, but I just want to get my quick thoughts about it again. My bad. I see. I see he's, he's hit with Fed charges. Uh, Y'all know when it when it comes to the Fed, people never really beat it. Even when a group like Murder, Inc., when they when they beat it, Irv Gotti and Ja Rule, they, they still was pretty much broke and Murder, Inc. never became to where they, where it used to be. You know what I mean? So I just want to get my quick thoughts about it again and tell me what y'all think.